healthy nails, and happy hands with Amber Bamber. Let's promote growth of our healthy nails and cuticles. It's easy to neglect your nails, but taking some basic steps can keep your fingernails healthy, happy, and strong. Keep your fingernails dry and clean. Repeated and prolonged contact with water or harsh chemicals like cleaning products can contribute to weakened nail beds and split fingernails. Wear cotton-lined rubber gloves when washing dishes, cleaning, or using harsh chemicals. Not all polish remover is created equal. Acetone-free is the only kind of remover I suggest. Anything else dries out your nails and leaves them prone to cracking and peeling. Be gentle. Your nails are delicate. And leave your cuticles alone, mostly. The cuticle has an especially important purpose to serve. It seals the area at the base of the nail. When you cut or remove the cuticle, it breaks the seal of protection, leaving you vulnerable to bacteria and the possibility of an infection. You can push your cuticles back gently with a rubber cuticle pusher, but only once a week or so, and be sure to use oils or thick, creamy lotions beforehand. Don't bite your fingernails hang nails, or pick at your cuticles. These habits damage your nail bed. Even a minor cut alongside the fingernail can allow bacteria to enter and cause an infection. Exposing your nail beds to your mouth raises the chances that you will be stuck in the cycle of bacteria to nail beds and infected nail beds to your mouth forever. Gross! Stop it. Your nails are not tools. Instead of using your fingertips to open soda cans, remove stickers, and opening stubborn packaging, use actual tools for the job. This helps avoid cracks and peeling of the top keratin layer of your nail beds. It turns out that that emery board that has been sitting around in your house for years could be causing your nails to peel and snag. Consider a crystal or glass nail file that will create an even edge and can be used on the weakest of nails without further damaging them. Keep one with you, and it's important to wash any tools you use, like clippers, with soap and water, and then wipe down with rubbing alcohol regularly for the same reasons you clean your makeup brushes, to avoid issues with bacteria. Yuck. Prioritize nail health over length. Long nails are beautiful, but if you are someone that has struggled with thinner nails, snags, or breakage, a shorter style with a rounded edge will help you focus on building strength without having to worry about anything else. Trim them straight across, then round the tips in a gentle curve. File in one direction only. Filing your nails in a sawing motion back and forth like you've seen in the movies will weaken your nails. Stay hydrated. Drinking enough water is essential for health, and nail health is no exception. Without adequate moisture, nails can become brittle and break and peel easily. Drinking enough water helps retain moisture and stay strong. Protein. Nails are entirely composed of fibrous protein called keratin. If you dream of having strong and healthy nails, you must first ensure a diet rich in high quality protein foods such as fish, leafy greens, nuts, seeds, and eggs. Dairy products or alternatives like almond milk or soy-based foods are excellent sources as well. Ask your doctor about biotin. Some research shows that it boosts the production of keratin. Add that protein I mentioned earlier and some whole grains for natural ways to get those nutrients, or add some biotin supplements to your diet after talking to your doctor. Oils. When it comes to maintaining healthy hands and nails, a simple daily massage of cuticle oil, vitamin E, or coconut oil, or even a mixture of olive oil and lemon, will bring you not just healthy cuticles, but also healthy nails and skin. Constant hand washing and use of hand sanitizer can dry out your nails. Moisturize your hands and nails often using thick, absorbent hand creams. Do this multiple times a day, especially after exposing your hands to products that dry out your hands. And make that double for the harsh, dry winter months. 
take a closer look at your shampoo. If you're using shampoo that is drying or aims to strip oils, that is one that is for oily hair, it might be drying out your nails too. Try changing up your shampoo for a couple of weeks and see if you notice a difference. Apply a protective layer. Protect your nails with a nail hardener or liquid strengthening face coat. This can be worn under or over your Color Street manis. I like to wear a coat or two in between my polish while I'm giving my nails some time off. Don't ignore problems. If you have a nail problem that doesn't go away on its own or is associated with other signs and symptoms, consult your doctor or dermatologist for an evaluation. Be consistent. Remember that like anything else, healthy nails don't happen overnight. The steps to healthy nails and happy hands do take a little extra time and effort. If it didn't, you wouldn't need these tips. But with proper care and consistency, you'll see your nails happy and healthy in no time.